Hi guys, I'm trying to do this video as quick as possible because it's the holiday and my kids are at home and there might be noise in the background. So I'm going to be showing you guys how I got these, how I achieved this look. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. How are you guys doing today? Hope you're having a lovely day. And if you're new to my channel, my name is Cynthia. And, and guys, please, if you haven't subscribed to my channel, what are you waiting for? Hit that subscribe button. Anyway, guys, I have had loads and loads and loads of requests saying, can you, ch can you share your hair? Share how you got this hairstyle. Or, I don't know how to put the phrase, but you know what I, you know what, you guys, you know what I mean, you know? I'm not into hair tutorial, so it's like, share your hairstyle, sit with, with me with you guys so without further ado let's get started i've started painting now my house so i'm excited transformation is all coming true anyway let's get started guys look at the look at this look at this these are twist as you can see they are tiny i don't know how these i'll show you guys they are twist twisting as you can see guys and they are extremely micro tiny twist you know I got this hair was custom made for me you can get this in any African shop for about a hundred pound but I tell you guys one thing you wouldn't get it as thin and as and as smooth as these these were custom made for me from Nigeria and this one cost me a hundred and fifty pound yes 850 pound in pounds guys not in naira and i invested in two this one is the black one and then the other one i got is a brown one so so basically i spent about 300 pound and uh this is the brown one i don't know if you can see the color it's a brown one when you do get them, uh, if you do buy something like this, I would advise you guys to wash it first and just plain shampoo or conditioner. Personally, I wash mine with conditioner, not a shampoo, because it comes with this chemical smell And uh, before you put it on. As you can see, I've got this natural line that looks like my scalp on the hair extension, or I would say on the wig, but that's not actually my scalp. What I have on here is this a uh, wig cap which i bought from my local beauty shop these are 149 for the price of two i bought this cream color and i also have a brown one so yeah and it opens up like this so basically when you put it on and you have the the um wig cap over it it kind of give it a scalp color some people wear black wig cap but i go with a brown one or a light brown one just to give it that natural look so you get something like this and uh, this is how thin the hair is you know I'm quite happy for my investment because in less than say five minutes I can get myself a nice looking slit hair to go to any occasion be it work business I just flip it up I just flip it on you guys mom of four I have to look presentable it's not compulsory though, but this is my own routine. <laughs> so don't say I'm not saying you have to, but this is my own. And uh, yeah, this is the second one I bought. It's not as long as the one I have on. The one I have on is extremely long. It goes up to my waistline. And uh, how it comes is it comes in a wig cap, just like this. And this is how the inside look like. This is how the inside look like. And it has also an elastic band at the end of the at both sides to help secure the wig when you put it through it uh, it also has um clips to make it tight to whatever adjustment you want to adjust it to so and to be honest guys I love this the second one is not as long as my black one on it comes in a breathable net cap and I can see go through to your hair because it's really full you can't really see but it is a net you can see my hand is a net 
it's a net so it's kind of breathable and uh, yeah and that's how the inside looks like this is the closure in the front and it is definitely a net like material but well, you can hardly see it here but let's see it is a it's quite a full head of hair but it's a net like material so you wouldn't you wouldn't have your head sweating no but like i said please wash it before use because of the smell so yeah i have adjusted the strap to my head size and i'm just going to put this behind my head behind i'm going to put the elastic band to secure it behind my head so when the wind blow or when i it's not flying off my head or if my son pulls it mistakenly it doesn't fly off the head so yeah so you put it down like this first and then i'm just i've secured the back just going to pull it down to the back and then okay and then i'm just gonna and that's it you know and that's it and then i just have to secure here pull it forward i like booking it sideways for today and then you just cover up the other part and uh that's it guys all done all done all done and like i said this wig was custom made from me from Nigeria and I paid 150 pound for one of for one and I bought two and guys look at this just look at this look at that anyway guys that's the end of my hair tutorial I hope you like it and guys please don't forget to like and subscribe and Thank you so much for all your support and see you some other time. Bye guys.